<laughs> Welcome to the OC Fast Stats Monthly Update, brought to you by the Orange County Association of Realtors. All expectations in 2015 are for a healthy and energetic selling season. National Stories have been highlighting an increase in new construction sales and pending sales, but National Stories are not always readily applied to the local scene. All the same, if ever there was a year to list or purchase a home, wider economic factors seem to indicate that this is the one. Pending sales increased 20.8% from March 2014 to 2015 for detached homes and increased 22.1% for attached homes for the month. Buyer activity seems to have gotten off to a rocket start this spring. Inventory levels are sluggish, but it's still too early to expect a continuation of this trend. The number of homes for sale were down 14.7% to 4,153 for detached homes, while attached homes were down 25.9% to 2,194. Listings were down overall, but this is still not quite a cause for alarm. The selling season is just underway in most neighborhoods. Prices were up over the last year at this time. The median sales price increased 4.1% to $685,000 for detached homes. Attached home values are also rising, up 4.2% to $406,500. Upward price movement is mostly a welcome occurrence due to its signifying a healthy growth market. Month supply of inventory was down 15.2% to 2.8 months for detached homes and down 20.7% to 2.3 months for attached homes. Sellers, on average, are accepting lower amounts than were being accepted at this time last year. Percent of original list price received at sale remained flat for detached homes at 97% and down slightly to 96.8% for attached homes since last year. On average, more people are employed and making more money than they were at this time last year. The jobs picture as a whole looks promising. Employment drives home buying activity, so it is ever critical to watch labor statistics as a key indicator for the residential real estate market. Coupled with the mostly positive jobs picture, it is widely expected that mortgage rates will remain as they are for at least the first two quarters of the year. That's the update for this month. Check back next month for the latest.